So my name is Andrew Shaver. I'm an account executive with NewGen. Um, we're a genomics company focused on NGS and microarray solutions in San Francisco. Uh, if you haven't heard of us, can I just ask um, who in here is doing NGS or um, is interested in doing NGS in the future? Got some users over there. Okay, great. Um, so. So NewGen, um, in the past, we were known, we've been around for about 15 years. In the past, we've been known for low input, low quality. We've changed that. We have solutions that cover a broad range of samples, low quality to high quality, low input to high input, um, and all sorts of applications. So we have RNA-seq, DNA-seq, methyl-seq, RRBS, targeted enrichment, for uh, DNA and RNA, amplicon sequencing, um, fusion analysis, and, and a lot more. So, a lot of different applications there. Um, a few, so I'm going to talk mostly about RNA seq today, um, and I'm going to make this brief because I'm the gateway to lunch. Um, it puts me in a powerful position. Um, so, some challenges in RNA seq uh, input requirements. Uh, sometimes, uh, if it's degraded or if it's just not enough there. Um, and not enough data, um, and I'll get to some of our technology with the depletion technology um, to increase the number of informative reads um, out there. Um, inaccurate mapping, um, rare transcripts, um, we've done a lot of viral detection recently and I'll get into that a little bit too. Um, so these are the four rna products that we have uh, kind of right now. Um, I'm going to touch a little bit more extensively on two of them. Uh, Solo and Trio. Uh, Solo, we have for about a year right now. I was actually uh, on the development team uh, about a year ago when we developed this, so I've done this kit far too many times. Um, it's our single cell and low input RNA kit. Um, so we can go down to 10 picograms or a single cell. Um, we do have a direct lysis um, workflow as well to do that. Um, Trio is brand new. Um, we actually haven't shipped any yet. We're starting shipping next week, but we have uh, release the product. Um, it combines, you know, I think our next slide. Yeah, here we go. This is better. So, our Trio kit combines our cDNA generation technology, which is single primer isothermal amplification, um, and puts it into our library prep kit with enzymatic fragmentation, which allows this workflow to be fully automatable and completable in a single day. Um, some of the best um, early access customer information that we've gotten back with uh, Trio RNA-seq uh, is the ability to detect low abundance transcripts. Um, we've seen some incredible data. Um, actually, yesterday, uh, one of my customers from University of Minnesota, um, and usually we don't like say names, but they tweeted us, so I'm just gonna it's public anyway. Um, there, the vet school there um, is doing viral detection and they were able to detect um, uh, quite a bit of um, transcripts that they had not seen in other kits, um, which is great. And I, uh, for any of those who are interested, um, I can definitely get some of that data too. Um, our other two kits here, Universal RNA-Seq and Universal Plus. Uh, we've had Universal for a while. It's kind of our general run-of-the-mill RNA-Seq solution um, with good quality RNA. Um, our Solo, Universal and Universal Plus, great stranded libraries, um, so that's a plus. And uh, as it says, for everyday whole transcriptomics. Input levels there, 10 to 250 nanograms, um, also works with FFPE. Our Universal Plus is also brand new, we haven't released it, but that'll be released in April as well. Um, and that's an mrna C kit, it's also stranded, um, and some input requirements down there. So our depletion technology is called AnyDeplete. It's formerly known as Indice, Insert Dependent Adapter Cleavage, but we've changed the name to AnyDeplete um, because it is fully customizable. We can deplete any organism, any transcript from any genome. Um, we can combine things. Um, so our typical is human. We have a lot of human, but we also have probes that are targeting uh, mouse, rat, uh, Drosophila, ribosomal RNA usually. Um, but we can do host depletion too. Um, we've done experiments where we're depleting ribosomal and some hosts. Um, it's you know our bioinformatics team takes care of most of these designs, but 
Um, it is fully customizable. Um, oh, there's an animation. Um, so what we do is we throw the probes on um, Illumina platform uh, compatible libraries. We throw these probes on. Um, they grab onto these unwanted transcripts, um, gets rid of them, and that allows um, degradation of those unwanted transcripts. And now you're left with uh, what you want, which um, leads to a lot more efficient sequencing. Um, I have some slides later on, I don't think I'm going to get to them, but it shows uh, that our ribosomal depletion we typically bring down from anywhere. Uh, it can be up to 80% ribosomal RNA in some species, um, so anywhere between 40 and 80% we bring those down uh, below 10, um, so you're getting a lot more informative reads, um, which also allows for um, more detection of the low abundance transcripts, and you don't have to sequence as deep. Uh, another thing with all of our kits, we have a dimer-free technology um, where um, we're able to produce libraries down to a very low input. Um, the bottom up there is a 10 picogram input. Um, this is actually my data from R&D, so I'm especially proud of this. Um, and we have a few other competitors um, that we did the same. Uh, they're ultra-low uh, protocols. And it's almost all dimer. Um, and now there's more and more research being done with the pattern flow cells having a lot of problems with dimers. So it's uh, becoming more and more crucial to get these dimers out. Um, and not just the dimers, but uh, we're able to make libraries down to 10 pgrams as well. Uh, pretty good looking libraries too. Um, so, back here. so I'm just going to summarize this. Um, uh, Usually these conversations lead to a lot more specific conversations. So if you are doing NGS, um, I would absolutely love to talk to you individually. Um, we can set something up. I can come back and meet, meet with you guys in your lab um, and talk about individual applications. Because one thing NewGen does do well is uh, we work with you guys to whatever application you need. We'll customize things. Um, we have a great field application support. Um, so I would love to have those conversations um, before I head out today. Um, so Solo is our single cell, uh, low input RNA, works with the worst of the samples, lowest RIN numbers you can possibly think of, and DB200 scores, we've gotten libraries um, out of pretty much anything. The joke at New Gen is you just throw something in and it'll make a library. Um, our TRIO RNA-seq is uh, a robust cDNA generation and amplification along with library prep and our any depletion technology. Our universal is our standard run of the mill and our universal plus mRNA seed kit is for mRNA. All four of these have our fully customizable depletion so we can deplete all your ribosomal RNA, globin, or any hosts. Um, yeah, that's, that's us at NewGen. Um, I wanna make sure you guys uh, get lunch so I'll Called on that. Thank you. Yep.